Let's go. Oh my god. Wow. Wow, this man self-destructs after you destroy him. Are you kidding me? No, my luck. Oh my gosh, I'm about to go to sleep, y'all. What's going on, you guys, man? Welcome back. Welcome back, man. As you already know, man, we back in some Fallout 4. Yes, sir. Strong is getting dropped. <laughs> now, Strong is dope, but sometimes he be acting slow. I'm not going to lie. But, hey, man, as I can see where we left out from the last episode, man, we rescued that little, um, whatever his name is. I think that's him right there. Is it? Yeah, it's definitely, I think it's him. Hmm. Never mind. I'm looking at a whole mannequin. All right. <laughs> but, hey, man, I hope you guys have been enjoying the series thus far, man. And as I can see, I'm a little colder. And I'm not going to lie. It's a little chilly in the crib. You feel me? Had a little... little Productive busy day and now we just hopping on some fallout, but you know yapping, right? <laughs> Thank you guys for tuning in man. God bless you all and before we get going y'all let's um I want to travel to The castle real quick. I want to see something Man these guys are freaks mm. Let's see where this episode of fallout 4 is going to take us this is the castle strong this is the castle what did i who is this girl probably just another minute man <clears throat> ah there you are finally i've been waiting to talk to you oh word speak to ronnie shaw at the castle Broadcasting all day, all across the Commonwealth. Nothing to report. Stay safe, people. Here I am. What did you need? I'm Ronnie Shaw, Commonwealth Minutemen. At least I was. Back before Joe Becker got himself killed and the idiots took over. Glad to meet you. We can use some more veterans around here. Ah, well, you're right about that. I feel like some of these you've got still may need their diapers changed. <laughs> I'd still like to hear what you came to talk to me about. Heard you were trying to get the Minutemen back on their feet. Thought I'd come see the new general for myself. So what's your story? What makes you think anybody even wants the Minutemen? The Commonwealth needs the Minutemen. People are starting to realize that. I've heard some good things. Wouldn't be here otherwise. Now that I'm here, I can see you really need my help. <laughs> this girl funny. Are you offering to rejoin? I guess I am. But first things first. I'm probably the only one who still remembers this. But the castle's armory was located in the West Bastion. The castle's castle armory? Weapons, ammo, schematics, you name it. Where? I'll show you. Hold on. I do need some new weapons. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I feel me. And some new ammo. Definitely need some ammo. I'm pretty low. Hmm. What are we supposed to do here? Looks like it might still be intact. Door still sealed. Bastion hasn't collapsed. The trick now is finding a way in. I hope you have an idea. Of course I do. If you can't go through, go around. Let's have a look at the northeast bastion. This is Radio Freedom. Okay. Broadcasting all day, all across the Commonwealth. Nothing to report at the moment. Stay tuned for updates. Yeah, I'm a little impatient right now. I'm trying to see. Um, what type of weapons this thing got? Oh, man. They sealed this thing up pretty good, ain't they? Bro, we need to talk, bro. Why are you always running around with a melee? Where's your gun, bro? Did I, did I take all your ammo and that's why you're not using your gun? I don't know. This was the general's quarters. There used to be a tunnel leading from here to the armory. Hmm. Mm. Blocked by this rubble. We'll have to find some way to clear it. Go. Okay. I just want to see what type of weapons in there. Ah, okay. So I need something. Hold on. What does girl say? How am I supposed to clear this, y'all? Hmm. Dang. Hold on. Let me see what the mission said. The mission usually helps out. I could level up. 
I don't really know what to build. And even if I did, I can't even build the um the weapons workbench. Dang. I'm, I'm gonna try to speak with this girl. I might have to hit up one of my resources, y'all. I might have to hit up one of my plugs that, you know, help me out here because I don't know what I'm supposed to craft. And this girl disappeared, it seems. Minuteman sleeping, dope. Alright, y'all. I'm gonna see if I can figure this out and I'll be right back you guys from a little investigating you know a little research doing um i did see i could just scrap this off and it's that simple i thought i had to build something so let's see right now oh wow <laughs> wow okay dope we got that done let's get down there and see if there's still a way through all right Maybe whip out my weapon just in case. You never know. Mm. Wow. Oh my gosh. These eggs are so freaky, bro. I'm looking at them and it's like giving me chills, bro. Oh, wow. That's a hold on. Let me see. I'm trying to bait it. Yeah, never mind. I'll just pick it up. What's brain fungus? Uh, yeah, that's weird. I'm not gonna lie, that's weird. I need to get away from this. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, I know. That was very stupid of me. What is this? It's a roach. Dope. Hmm, cannonball. Okay, 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 okay. We'll just take take one of those. Um, let me do what I'm supposed to do. I'm here trying to investigate too much. Where did this girl go? I don't know. I'm just trying to. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Strong. That's done. It seems like my leg is definitely injured because of these dang mines, bro. Oh my gosh. I think I do have a power cell for my power armor. Nice. Let's definitely take that. I mean a fusion core, yeah. This is pretty crazy. Just gonna pick those up. Never know. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. I don't think. I don't think. I think it's good. Oh, all right. No, I'm sorry. That was a total accident. I actually thought this man was on our side for a second. Hmm. It would be dope if he was on our side, though. Oh my god, bro. It's like I'm hurting my own teammates. Oh yeah, she got wrecked. Dang, I ain't gonna lie, we're getting wrecked right now. This is not good. This is not good at all. Okay, it's three against one, yeah. It is three against one, so we should be able to do a little something. As long as he doesn't take care of me. It looks like he's trying to take me out. I don't really have any, um any more healing to be honest with y'all this mess are you kidding me come on i can't even run now bro oh my gosh why did i do that 
Wow, it is wrapped. I'm not even going to save the game here because I'm in a very bad position. Yeah, I'll just let myself get wrecked. I was in a very bad position, y'all. That was not good. I'm going to go ahead and pick up more of these. It seems like they gave some good amount of health. Let me, let me just double check, but it does seem like they give good health. Well, not. Definitely don't, but, but it's something though. It is something, and of course we gotta face off a giant robot. Maybe I have to go back upstairs. To be honest, to grab the um some rocket launcher ammo or anything. Okay, that's taken care of. Now we're just gonna switch our ammo. I mean our weapon. Hmm. Let me switch. Put this on. Let me put my sniper on real quick, just so I could attack that thing from long range. Oh, dope. I think these are definitely. All right, y'all. We're gonna try this out. Okay, okay, so let's quick save real quick. Oh my gosh, this is a terrible idea. Mm, I don't know what weapon to really use against him. I just need something I could kind of spam in a way. Yeah, I should have just picked up like a submachine gun. I think Strong has like a submachine gun for me. That's what I just use. Instead of these semi auto rifles, that takes forever. Where did the girl go, bro? She just ran away, dog. This is not good. Hold on, I'm gonna try something crazy. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I got wrecked. Dang, bro, this is harder than I thought, bro. How am I supposed to kill this robot? Do I need, and let me see. I think I'm gonna have to use this. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. Right now I'm getting wrecked. I don't know how we're supposed to beat this man. Mm, I'm, gonna have to, I'm gonna see if I could buy. I'm gonna see somebody has some missiles for me, bro. I think that's what I need to use. Some rocket launchers. Because ain't no way. I'll just let him wreck me real quick. You got it, bro. You got it. You got it. Let's go find some rocket launchers, y'all. Because this is ridiculous. Well, you guys, to be completely real with y'all, um, I went <laughs> to go get some rocket launcher ammo. I was able to get three. Right. So now, oh my god. Okay, like, bro. Dang. I'm sorry, strong. Strong listening. Now I gotta wait till strong gets up, bro. I was able to get I was able to get three rocket launcher ammo and I have two Molotovs, so we're gonna try to do what we gotta do. I do have a flamethrower, I don't know if I have it on me though. Damn, I might be buzzing a flamethrower, I don't know. I got it. Oh, never mind. It's a flare gun. I'm tripping. I'm just waiting to storm get up. All right. There we go. All right, y'all. This is just so annoying, bro. Wow. I would have just ignored this if I knew. But then again, I want that moolah. 
Uh oh. I think it's coming, y'all. That's a L. That is a L. Dang, yeah, there's a L. I don't even want to use my rocket launcher because then. I'm a, I'm a damage my girl. Wow. It's just a L, y'all. I might just have to say freak this armory. Now I gotta debate if I wanna keep this in the video or not, cause this is just embarrassing. <laughs> this is just embarrassing. Let's see what we could do here. Honestly, just gotta let my teammates do their thing. That was a terrible idea. Now, to be honest, y'all, I just gotta use my submachine gun at this point. This real tactical here. I gotta use my mines, my bombs, because I want to take care of this. I just need him to walk in that trap, y'all. We almost got him, but we're not doing any damage. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty close. Let me just save the game here, to be honest. I did not want to use up all my ammo, but. Okay, I got a pebble shooter. It's not gonna do nothing. I need strong to get up. I think we're getting close to the breaking point now. Oh yeah. Yep. It's doing something. It is doing something. And it's a good thing that it doesn't chase me all the way to the ends of the earth. Cause then I'll be ridiculous. I just gotta keep playing like a coward. And I'm gonna need you to get up, right? There you go. Come on, do your thing. Oh. Don't get destroyed. We almost got it. We almost got it, yeah. Oh my god, this is about to be the team bit. I don't know, Strong is seem like he's useless right now, I don't know. Oh, let's not choke here. Look how close we are to killing Sarge. If only you was an our side, Sarge. Oh my gosh, I'm missing the clutches shots. You're already down? No, you're not down. 
Let's go. Oh my god. Wow. Wow, this man self-destructs after you destroy him. Are you kidding me? No, oh, my luck. Oh my gosh, I'm about to go to sleep, y'all. <laughs> okay. So same tactic here. Go ahead and get up for me, buddy. Just keep on getting up. Every time you get knocked down, just keep on getting up. I did not. Oh, nice. A mini man just came and helped me. So, could I have called him in the whole time? That would be dope if you could take off your teammates. Starn has been chilling there. He's definitely putting up an axe. Okay, we almost got him. This is literally like a boss fight. Okay, yeah, we know to run. You ain't about to get me this time. I get strong, you actor. Oh man, let me see what you got for me, dog. I appreciate this. Hmm, choosing core is dope. Definitely need that. Okay, we'll pick up all of that good stuff, right? Oh man. Okay. I'm guessing I might have to open it through inaccessible. So how am I supposed to get this open? Oh my gosh. <laughs> ah, let's see. I used to know this password. One if I land. Nah, that's not it. We're waiting here patiently. Time. <laughs> Dialogue in this game is so dope, United yeah. We stand. Dope. Yeah, that was it. Dope. Oh wow. You do have some plasma though. I will pick up this. That's tough. There's a general. I definitely need I've been needing some plasma cartridge. I appreciate that. Dang, man. Now rest in peace. I'm surprised Judy ain't gonna say none. Oh. Oh, that's a flamer. I thought this was some type of, like, crazy weapon. I mean, this gun is crazy, though. I was looking for Cosworth. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. This man has my mini gun and, like, a whole lot of my other weapons. Go ahead and push this so we can get that door open. There we go. Ah, man, beautiful. What is this man doing in here? Wow. Artillery supplies. Oh, wow, this is dope. Oh, wow. I'm gonna have to build this our artillery then. Fat man. Well, it seems like we're going to build the artillery now. But I do have too many things. 
to admit, Ronnie, having artillery would help out quite a bit. Oh, we used to rain down fire on death claws and super mutants alike. It was a glorious thing. I am carrying too much, though. You're gonna pick up all this ammo. Um, buddy. I'm gonna need you to carry something for me. I don't know what it is. Hey. But let's talk a little bit. Let's see. I'm definitely gonna build that artillery, y'all. I got too many weapons I could care less about, bro. Like the submachine gun? I really don't care about that. That's a pebble. Demon. I'm definitely gonna take up this fat man, though. I don't know what type of weapon that is, but I need that. Oh my gosh. So it's like a rocket launcher. Okay. I just need the ammo. Dope. Dang, this fat man is actually pretty fat though, I'm not gonna lie. Alright y'all, so that took a whole lot of more time than I thought it hey would. Ah, looks like you've got everything we need. As soon as you get some artillery built, we'll do a test fire to calibrate it. Okay, so let's go ahead and build the artillery. Specials. Okay, there we go. Use artillery. Um, where do I want to build this artillery? Did I just build the artillery somewhere I don't even know about? I don't know, but to be honest, I'll just build it right here. Right, I think I built the artillery up there by accident if I don't know it. Eleven PM out there. Okay, I need to sign a worker. Nothing to report. Stay safe, General. I just need to trade gear with you. Sure thing. Fam, I'm trying to assign you to something. Dope. Now we got our artillery, y'all. Oh, this is gonna be dope. This is Debbie gonna help me take revenge. On that satellite, whatever it's called, satellite array. I'm a, I'm a deed that, bro. Excuse me. Ah, gosh darn! It's good to see artillery here again. Now here's the thing about the big guns: they can't fire at anything too close, but their range is impressive. That's what the smoke grenades are for. Toss one of those at the bad guy. If we have artillery and range, we'll confirm over the radio and target our fire on your smoke. At first, we better do a test fire. Make sure we're hitting what we're aiming at. You see that little building over there? We use that for our aim. Keep your radio on and tune to Radio Freedom so we can confirm we're ready. Okay. Strong, I don't think you want to stay there, buddy. Hey, over here. Come here, bro. Sorry's a little slow, man. Move here. I'm waiting for the shot. Maybe I gotta go back a little bit more. Okay, so the artillery, the artillery do take a while, it seems. Okay, let's see how massive this explosive is about to be. Oh man, yeah, this is... Oh. They're shooting some more, they're not done. Okay. 
Okay. I thought it was only one shot, y'all, but they out here wrecking. Word? That's how you feel it? Wow. They're not done. Oh, this is amazing. This is amazing. Wow. Okay. We got it. We got it. Okay, so this is my nuke. This is this is my nuke. Mmm, right now I'm thinking about satellite array. I need to take revenge. <laughs> I need to take revenge. Let's go, bro. That is so dope. Let's go. Wow. Wow, we're lit now. Okay, so we're gonna continue on. Um, this episode's probably not gonna be too long, y'all. Especially since I'm recording this around nighttime right now. But what I am gonna do real quick is that we're gonna go to Diamond City. We're gonna go to Diamond City. Oh, hmm, it's time me to talk to Preston. Okay, so before we go to Diamond City, let's talk to Di um whatever his name is, Preston. And see what he has to say. But we're just gonna go to Diamond City and just meet up with a guy. You know, the guy we, that we saved. We're gonna recruit um, Piper or whatever her name was. I'm not really sure. But yeah. Then I think we'll just probably end it right there. You know, we're gonna keep it a little smooth this episode. A little I'll try shorter. To make I've been looking for card work for a while. I said I knew I know I sent him to the sanctuary. I could not I cannot find him. It's like he's hiding. I gotta hand it to you, General. You really turned things around for the Miniman. I never thought I'd see the day that the Miniman had artillery support again. We should see about building them at all our settlements to expand our coverage. And Ronnie Shaw returns. Mm. Something else, isn't she? I'm definitely going to do that. Yeah, she definitely knows how to take charge. Ha, that's a bit of an understatement from what I hear. I'd heard stories about her from the old timers, but I didn't know she was still around. The fact that she's come back to the Miniman means we must be doing something right. I'll let you know if I hear of any settlements that need our help. In the meantime, make sure to offer help to anyone that needs it. I do. I do got to help out some settlements. I'm not going to lie. I've been, you know, we were been a little busy with Diamond City the last episode. And yeah. But let me see if I can build these beds real quick. Because I know they wanted me to build some beds. Let me see if I have enough equipment now. Yes, I do. So where do we want this? I want to build it somewhere where it makes sense. <laughs> you know? Okay, yeah. It ain't no making sense, bro. No making sense, man. We're just going to build these. Because why not? I'm honestly gonna put one right here. I don't think it really matters where we build these. But, you know, I guess I'm just gonna spread it out just for the heck of it. Well, I need more cloth now. Okay, so whenever we do that, you know. Hold on. I'm tripping. I could just, yeah. I could just crap. Okay, there we go. Oh, we just got that mission over with. Nice. 
I felt great. Let's go ahead and, you know, we're just taking things one step at a time. This episode might be a little chill, whatever, but, you know. Well, boss man. I like it. Having a place to sleep will improve everyone's spirits. Yes, what sir. What we need now is a reliable source of clean water. All right, so... I'm on it. Clean water. Great. Thanks again. Or about that another time. At least um, it's not raining. To be honest, I don't think. Yeah, we'll worry about that another time, y'all. Let's go to Diamond City. All right. We're just gonna just budge in these houses and just go through the back, you know, no biggie. All right, we got a creepy mannequin in here. Dope. You don't have any back door, okay, I was about to say. Like, I know you got a back door, buddy. Okay. We're gonna talk to Mr. Valentine's here Ellie? now. Are you here? Nick? Oh dope. Go ahead and grab that. Really, you. It's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Hey, happy to do it. Yeah? Go diving into scary pre war ruins all the time, then, do you? Here. I know an amount wasn't on the table when you went out to find him, but you deserve a reward. Plus a little something extra. You know, if you're looking for work and don't mind putting on the detective hat, Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. Take a seat. Come on. I let me pick up these bobcats at least. <laughs> I definitely need to take out this vault We're trying to find someone who's gone missing. The devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can. No matter how painful it might be. She just looking at... Oh man, okay, this is gonna be interesting. Let me describe the vault first. We were in a vault when it happened. Vault 111. It, it was some kind of cryo facility. You were on ice. More importantly, you were underground, sealed up. A lot of obstacles to get through just to take one person. What else can you tell me? My wife was... murdered. She was trying to keep them from taking Sean, and they... They just... It's okay. You don't need to say anything more. So, we're talking about a group of cold-hearted killers waited until something went wrong to resort to violence. Anything else you remember? My wife was... It's okay. So, anything? There was a man and a woman. They didn't say much. But I remember they called me the backup. So we're talking a small team. Professionals. The kind that know to keep their lips tight when they're on the job. Not sure what the backup Anything else you remember? We're looking for my son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Well, that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. 
Whoever took your kid had an agenda. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the gunners. And of course, there's the Institute. Mm -hmm. So you think this Institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. Something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer models, good as human, infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. I'm a synth myself. So the Institute of Robots. Hey, yo. You gonna talk? You're a prototype? As far as I know. Never seen any other synth like myself. There's the older ones that are dumb as rocks and all metal. And there's the newer ones that are almost human. I'm somewhere in between. Either way, I need to find Sean. Right. Speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? The woman was dressed in, um, I think it was a kind of hazard suit. The man had some sort of metal brace on his arm. Maybe I don't remember what they looked like. A lot of hired guns do that to look tough. Hazard suit is interesting. Not many mercs can afford something that fancy. What else do you remember about them? One of them came right up to me. Bald head. Scar across his left eye. Wait. It couldn't be. Oh, shoot. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? I... Might have. Everything was foggy. Mm. Way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? He oh. had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned West Stands. The wow. The him was around 10 years old. I, I don't know if it's Sean or not. Because I don't even know how old Sean could be. You said he lives here? He's still in town? They both vanished a while back, if I'm remembering right. That house is still there. Let's you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. I always am. Wow. Things are getting pretty interesting here, y'all. They're really interesting, actually. Okay. The story seems like it gets really deep, too. I am definitely fascinated, bro. I didn't want Ellie to hear this, but I think you should know. Everything I dug up about Kellogg before his disappearance, bad news. He's more than just a mercenary. He's a professional. Quick, clean, thorough. Has no enemies. All dead. Except you. Nine to one odds says he's our man. It's more than just you identifying his distinguishing features. The M.O. is all him as well. Leading a small team to kidnap a baby and leaving one of the parents alive for later? Not many mercs in the Commonwealth can pull that off. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. Dang, I'm not gonna lie. I have not played Cyberpunk, even though I know Cyberpunk's a little futuristic. But it's like since I'm speaking to like a synth or a prototype, I don't know. I'm just kind of getting Cyberpunk vibes. I may be tweaking, big tweaking. 
I would actually love to play Cyberpunk, though. I'm not gonna lie. If y'all want to see Cyberpunk on this channel, because I know it's a great game. Something to hide, Kellogg. Let me know. You give it a try. Bro, I'm no master, bro. Lock's really strong. I'm not a master yet, dog. Tell me to give it a try. Lock tight. Hey, Valentine. See that platform in the distance near the city entrance? That's the elevator to the mayor's office. Why don't you go ask around there? You can't get through that door. Hmm. Yeah, we're just gonna jump down, y'all. But yeah, like I was saying, I want to see Cyberpunk. I could definitely bring that to the channel for you. I think that would be a dope playthrough, to be completely real. Jesus. Do you ever think maybe you could get a man's attention easier if you use softer words, honey? Maybe shout a little less. Oh, that reminds me of this article I'm writing about the mayor's affair with a certain air-headed blonde. Oh, look who it is. What brings you to the mayor's office, huh? What are you doing here, Piper? Trying to find out why the mayor happens to be meeting with the same suspicious looking courier every other week. Not from any settlement I've ever heard of. And not from a caravan. Always in and out before anyone has a chance to talk to him. An errand boy from the Institute, maybe. After this article comes out, that's what everyone's going to be asking. If you are done crowding the reception area, Miss Piper, the mayor needs to make time for more responsible citizens. <laughs> I was just leaving anyway. The mayor's receiving visitors as long as they aren't members of the press. Did you need help? So I can just head in and talk to McDonough? Go right ahead. His office is open. He likes to make time for everyone when he can. Yeah. Remember you, our new arrival. I wish I was in your shoes, getting to see our glorious city for the first time. How can I help you? Nick Valentine wanted me to see you. Did he now? Some investigation, I assume? You two aren't trying to get me into hot water now, are you? <laughs> A man named Kellogg used to live in this city. I need to search his house. I see. Well, whatever reasons you have, I take my citizens' privacy very seriously. Even after they've left, I can't allow you to invade someone else's home. That's all there is to it. I mean, that's real. Please, Mayor McDonough. This man Kellogg kidnapped my son. I need to find him. I see. I'm sorry. However horrible the crimes this Mr. Kellogg may have committed, your word alone isn't hard evidence. My camera is about to overheat ya. Uh, I might have to bribe him. I understand. You have rules. Maybe for the right amount, you can bend them a bit. What? Ah. How dare you? I'm the mayor, for God's sake, not some thug for hire. So that's it? You're not going to help? Security is part of what keeps Diamond City above the petty squabbles and the misfortunes of the Commonwealth. I can't betray that for anything. Fine. Thanks for nothing. I know it's disappointing, but I have to think of all the people of Diamond City, not just the needs of one person. Hmm. The mayor is green. Let me see. I might have to buck the key.
Geneva. I'm gonna wake you up, man. Did you need something else? I need to talk to someone about Kellogg's old house in the West Stands. Mr. Kellogg's residence? He left town a while ago. We foreclosed on the property and locked it up. If there was something belonging to the man that you have a claim on? I don't have time. I need that key now. Why is finding this key so important to you, honey? Please. All I want to do is find my son. The man who owned that house kidnapped him. I've heard the sob stories before, so save them. Maybe we can reach an agreement? I just have to have the caps here. A gift? For me? Oh, how generous. Uh... Oh, there I go again, leaving a key out on my desk and forgetting to put it back. Wow. Dope. So what, do I just go to her desk? I guess the key just magically appeared, right? Nice. Outstanding. Well, let's go back to where we got to go now. This is getting pretty interesting. I'm liking the story, bro. I'm liking the story, dog. Okay, so here we are. We got the key, y'all. Uh. We got the Let's key. Take a look around. Kellogg must have left something behind. Place seems small to you. Think of a guy like Kellogg would think big. Hey, big things come from small things, man. Sometimes. <laughs> Handcuffs. Check out that desk. There's definitely probably an underground, like... Hmm. There's definitely something here, bro. Let me double check upstairs. It's probably on the desk. Hold on. I, I just see activate. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, my God. This is like a torture spot. We'll take the fusion cells. Using cores, I do appreciate all of this. Oh yeah, these new um, cokes are dope. Take the ammo. We'll take that grenade. Hmm. 
This man is blessing with all of this. Gwyneth Stout beer, 44 caliber bullets, and cigars. San Francisco Sunlights. Mm, interesting brand. Won't lead us anywhere on its own, though. Okay, so what do we get out of here? Any suggestions, Nick? Hmm. What about dog meat? Commonwealth mutt like him can drag a man's scent for miles. Why don't you go fetch him and let him have a whiff? See if he picks up the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. You have to face Kellogg on your own. Just say so. Besides, you already have plenty of company. You can't all go sniffing through the Commonwealth after one man. Oh, shoot. I could make Nick come with me. I want you with me on this, Nick. Strong has, uh, he has a big boy though. I'm gonna send Strong to the castle because I peeped that sanctuary. It's hard for me to find people there. All Strong, right. let's get that bastard. Let's go. It's your show from here on out, okay? You say jump, I'll say how high. Now, nah, Nick, you're pretty dope. Commonwealth yet. You're pretty dope, Nick. But I'm definitely gonna drop you though, cause I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna need that girl. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna need um Piper, whatever her name is. She's dope. Sometimes strong not understand human. Yeah, I know strong. Strong go with human. Not yet, but soon. Hurry. Strong just trying to find some milk. <laughs> But we're just gonna end the video right here, y'all. I do appreciate y'all for watching. This was a little smooth episode, nothing too crazy. You know, we're really getting more into the story. And I do have some quests that I need to do, like this freedom trail, I don't even know. And I gotta travel to this farm, I gotta travel to this. Mm, and I, I gotta take my revenge on satellite array. I have, I have whatever it's called now, that nuke. <laughs> whatever it's called, bro. Y'all know what I'm talking about, but yes, bro. But, hey, that was a pretty dope episode i hope you guys enjoyed man and without further ado we're just gonna end the video right here i love y'all and i appreciate all the love y'all been showing me we just hit 700 subscribers by the way as i'm recording it well not as i'm recording this but on the day that i'm recording this video but yeah man god bless you all and i appreciate y'all y'all tapping the discord all that good stuff man link in my bio link in the comments yeah hey man y'all already know how this goes man let's get it we're going, man. Let's turn up.